Hi, I'm Joanne Key and I am the Artistic Partnerships Manager at SEMA and also the um, Jazz Councillor for the Music Council of Australia. Hi Joanne. Hi. Um, uh, could you tell me a bit about the women in jazz uh, work that you've been doing in Sydney? Um, SEMA has been involved or actually set up a program for um, to promote the looking at a career option in jazz for young women and it started it will be our 12th year next year and it started by Sandy Evans who is a really amazing musician and a passionate advocate for um, actually broadening the reach of jazz into um, and, and allowing more women to enter that sector and the program has been incredibly successful and we're seeing um, intakes at the conservatoriums of music increasing now with women's into their um, yeah. programs. And would you say it's unique to Australia? Well, in the world? I mean I, I certainly haven't seen any other programs like it. Yeah. Well, we did some research and we actually found that it does look as though it is a fairly unique program. Oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and the, with regards to, to the Women's International Jazz Festival in Sydney, um, I know it's only the second year. Um, what, was that a natural progression from uh, the increase in women or just something that you were going to do anyway? It's just something that happened because um, one year we were doing our programming and we looked at it and we went, oh, there's a lot of really fabulous women um, here. Mm. We could actually make this into something larger and turn it into a women's festival. So it wasn't actually a contrived thing. It didn't oh, okay. happen because we thought we'd wave the banner for women. It actually was. There were an amazing... They were amazing women musicians okay. who actually were going to play for us, and it didn't take much, um, much more to actually turn it, develop it into a festival. Um, but you can't help thinking that if it hadn't been for the ten years of work that had been put in before that, that you know maybe these women wouldn't be coming through. So well, that's definitely the case because uh -huh. we have a really strong pool of um, female artists to draw from. Great. Okay, well, we just want to thank you for um, looking after us here um, and hopefully we will be putting together some projects uh, to roll out in Scotland in the not-too-distant future. Thanks very much. Thank you.